<clears throat> hey, Keith. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, sorry. No. Hey. You, hey. We're here to play a very special game. What kind of game is it? Is it? Um. Well, Keith, it's uh, it's a Mario game. Okay, Kyle. What uh, kind of Mario game? That, I like those. We've played plenty. Yeah, it fits our theme. Yeah. Uh, but this one is for a system that you might not have heard of, but I know that you have. It's I, called. I may not have, were it not for me already having heard of it. Uh, it is. It's the the Philips Compact Disc Interactive System, or CDI for short. Sounds like it's not a real video game system. It's not, Keith, and it's not by Nintendo. Um, I can give you some history well, about this later on, but for right now, suffice it to say, this is a Mario game not made by Nintendo and not even on a Nintendo system. Right. It's it's on a system made by the people that make those shitty headphones you buy in an emergency. <laughs> <laughs> um, and because this is not a popular system, there's only one... Uh, emulator that it ex- exists for it and it's very bad and the system is also just bad to begin with so we have all kinds of layers of bad yeah, going yeah, yeah. on it's pretty bad so this is terrible the audio is like all out of sync i might fix that p- in post and mm-hmm. resync the audio yeah, to I'll it. Fix it yeah i'll fix it post and whatever but um just oh. i love how your mouse is oh. on top of the emulator mouse also, and it moves with it That's also so i should clarify that this um this emulator does not have controller support. Furthermore, it does not have keyboard support. The only way to interact with this uh, emulator is to, like, left on the D-pad is l- move the mouse left, and it just doesn't go off the screen, and right is right, and then A and B, or, like, one and two buttons are left and right mouse button. Yeah. But I'm using x pattern to map it to an Xbox 360 controller, but then for reasons I'll get into when we're actually playing the game, I actually need to do, like, left hand on the controller, right hand on the mouse. So this yeah, is so, going to be so this the is most a pile insane of, thing. Everything about this is going to be a pile of shit. Good luck. Um, We, we talked about this last week. Uh, this game's called Hotel Mario, Oh, yeah, we're playing Hotel Mario. Hold on. All it's, right, let's... You might have noticed the title above where you're seeing, where you're looking right now. It's, it starts pretty quick, so let's just get into this. Okay. Play. That was a nice little graphic, though. Yeah, that's yeah. nice. Yeah. Um, oh, this looks promising. And then I'll push the A button. And this is brought to you by some company called Fantasy Factory. That's all I know. That's all I know about they them. Really, they really didn't know how to make letters here. That is bad. That's a bad what they did. <laughs> nice of the princess to invite us over for a picnic, eh, Luigi? I hope she made lots of spaghetti. Luigi, look. <laughs> it's from Bowser. So good, I love this. These really pesky good. plumbers, the Koopalings and I, have taken over the Mushroom Kingdom. The princess is now a permanent guest at one of my seven Koopalings. Mario hotels. smoked like ten I packs of cigarettes. You find her if you can. Gotta find the princess. Look at Louis so startled. You gotta help us. If you need instructions, if you on need how to get through the hotel, <laughs> check out the enclosed instruction book. Instruction book? Thanks, Demon Mario. I only see in my nightmares. <laughs> oh man, they break the fourth wall right away. Hotel Mario. And then um let's, let's get so, in here. We also have these like looks kind of peaceful. Looks at the ceiling when sorry. are involved. I don't <laughs> I don't Here's know. my butt, Mario. <laughs> Take me. Take me. We have these insane, like, Hanna-Barbera, like, splash screens. So, um, all right. So what I was about to say, Kyle, was I didn't know anything oh, about this game. Real quick, my task here is to go around and push B on the doors to close all the doors in the hotel and then go up to the next floor. This Wait, is, but why do you need to close the doors? This is the game. Oops. I touched a Goomba. Oh, you went through the roots. Do you see that? Uh, you can jump on their heads, though, right? Yes. Why do, why do you have to... So... Why, what about closing the doors lets you go up? Well, no. I can go up whenever I want. It, the object... I move on to the next stage when I have closed all the doors. But the why? 
Don't you want to be checking the rooms? Keith, not- these are these are questions for your interrogation of Fantasy Factory and Phillips. I don't know. What? Fantasy Factory, why did you make this game? Phillips, how come the tape thing that I have in my car to play music doesn't work right? <laughs> oh, oh, I can hide in the doors. That's convenient. Can I close them with me in them? No. no. Okay, no. This. What, what do you think this is? Amnesia the Dark Descent? <laughs> I hide from the horrors in the <laughs> Koopa Hotel rooms. <laughs> What's your madness level at? Oh, there we go. The first time I've beaten a level good in dance. Hotel Mario. That's a good dance. So what I thought this was based on the name alone, and I, we mentioned this in what you have thrown out because it didn't work right, Okay. Uh, was a hotel simulator could, would have staked my life that uh, Hotel Mario was a hotel simulator. No, of course not. Uh, oh, I think I... The audio broke. I don't know if it was me or the emulator or both. I think it was the emulator. Well, I mean, I know it was... Mario is also broken, if you can see. I know it was the emulator, but I don't know if the a thing that I did was what caused the emulator to break. Anyway. Uh, I don't care. Okay. Um, it was kind of like listening to a nightmare. So... Let me explain real quick why this game exists. Um, so, wait, there was that mushroom on the side. Yeah. Next time that mushroom comes back, pay close attention to it because okay. it did not, not look like a mushroom. It looked like a thumb wearing a hat hopping along the ground. It was horrible. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so, at one point, Nintendo was playing with the idea of having a CD add on for the Super Nintendo. Uh, and they were talking to Sony about this, um, and I, I forget how far the talks got, but at one point they... Oh, the game broke. Oh, oh no, I No, won. it's fixed. It okay. fixed. Sorry. A we plus. thought it broke, but it actually is fixed now. Um, <laughs> there actually like is fixing. There actually is sometimes when you're playing this game, it will stop and give you an error message that says, like, the disc is dirty, you should try cleaning it. And I don't know where that's Ooh, coming from, if it's a bad ROM, if it's just the emulator, I have no idea. You, oh, you think there might be a du- some dust on the code? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the guy that made the ROM didn't think it would be a legitimate experience unless there was some dust in there? Uh, so so at one point, this, this I- the idea for this uh, CD add-on for the Super Nintendo by Sony was called the PlayStation. Oh, wow. And, uh, yeah, so that's basically the roots of PlayStation, is that that deal fell through for some reason, um, and Sony was like, well, screw you, we're gonna go make our own thing. And this, and I'm sure Nintendo laughed them off, like, good, good going, this'll go about as well as the Philips CDI that we don't know about yet. <laughs> um, so basically they, they dropped Sony and went with Philips, and then... And then it was less that the deal fell through, I think, and more that Nintendo went, actually, this is a bad idea. Um, but... Do you think it was just because... They're... Wait, but they were like... Are you saying that the, that they saw the CDI and said, oh, this is a bad idea? No, 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 the CDI okay. didn't exist okay, yet. Okay, okay, I see what Or you're actually, maybe it did. You know, I don't know the chronology. Okay. But I, I don't think it existed. Uh... Oh, it seems to just alternate. When I beat a level, the audio dies, oh, and then when I beat the next ev- level, only it comes every back. other level has of, audio. To of it. course. <laughs> okay. Um. And and so I think it was Nintendo just decided like a CD add- add-on is actually a bad idea, and I don't know if it was that as like reparations for like sar. There we go. Oh, there's some music. Great. Your disc is dirty. I don't, I don't know if it was as an apology or if it was just because they had made contracts with Philips and now had to, like, fulfill them, but um, Philips got license to make Mario and Zelda games for the CDI, and so the result of that was uh, this game, Hotel Mario. Hey, you skipped that uh, cutscene. Yeah, sorry. We had already seen it? Oh, that was the same cutscene. Yeah. Wait, why are we playing this this first world over? Because I got game over. Oh, okay. I'm glad that we get to hear this awesome music again. This is yeah. super good. This is like a this is like a weird combination of like the music from Luigi's Mansion and the Emerson Lake and Palmer album Carnival. <laughs> uh, so so that whole deal resulted in this game Hotel Mario, and I think more famously the Zelda games, right. uh, Zelda: The Wand of Gamelon, Link: The Faces of Evil, and something else and even more famously the emerson lake and palmer album carnival <laughs> ah 
God damn it. Of course I jumped and there was a guy. Up Why are there. you getting coins if you don't I don't I don't know. I don't know. Press coins button one. To I mean begin. like you'd think that they'd have a sonic thing going on cuz there's no mushroom or I guess there are mushrooms. Keep your eye out for that mushroom by the way. Yeah. It's super creepy. Uh, I think the when this when they were originally making this game, mm-hmm. they were planning on calling it something like S- Super Mario Wacky Worlds or something. Like it was kind of supposed to be like a a supposed sequel to Super Mario World, and then I think they decided it needed to come out a lot faster than they originally planned, and so it just got pared down to why would they decide this that they wretched pile of awfulness? They did a super bad thing. Like I think it might have. It- I could be completely wrong about this. I might I think it might have been like a CDI launch title. So they were like, we've wasted too much money on this CDI bullshit. Let's just put it out and hope that we don't lose too much money on it in total. Yeah. So just if we take do your lose, Mario thing and put it out. If we do lose the money on it, we'll just make it back from that sequel to the Emerson Lake Palmer album, Carnival. You are the worst. I'm just going to keep saying it until you laugh. Well, now there's some hot snare in here. I do hear that snare. That's a pretty good or, snare. Or just drums all together. I'm pretty sure it wasn't there before. Yeah, I totally don't know. You'd um, think that music would be the one thing that this would be able to do right. Well, it's an emulator. Look at look at the look at the mushroom. It's a thumb hopping along with a weird hat. I'm gonna get that mushroom. I'm gonna get that mushroom. Come on! Ooh, you're big now. Uh, my pants are glowing. Oh, can I? Am I invincible? Kind of. You're like, invisib- I, I you're am invincible. invincible. But so are the enemies. <laughs> um, and just real quickly, uh, the reason I have to do this with the the uh, controller and the mouse is because for some reason when I go up an elevator and I try to move out of the elevator, it doesn't work on the controller even though I'm very clearly moving the mouse. And to get out, I have to like wiggle the mouse. Can you? And then I can continue moving with the controller. You've got to tell me yes or no, am I crazy? Is that a hopping thumb with a hat? Is that what that is? It, <laughs> I would say it is not the most unlike a, a jumping thumb with a hat thing that I've ever seen. Okay, great. This is very stark now. Oh, it looks like when you get a kill, it extends your invincibility. So, a long time ago back before I actually investigated CDI emulators, mm-hmm. I kind of assumed like, oh, we'll play that terrible Mario game, and then we'll also just play the Zelda ones just for fun because it's they're so notably hilarious and bad. Mm-hmm. Uh, but now, like, the whole process of using this emulator is such a nightmare that I just, I'm not gonna, we're not gonna do that. We absolutely, I think that we should do it. I'll play it, I don't mind. We have to. I really, because no. I really want to see it. You've never seen it? No, I've never seen it's it. It's on YouTube. Mm. I don't want to. I know that you don't want to. That's why we have to. It's because no one else wants to. It's for the good of the world. Everyone's seen those Zelda CDI games. I haven't. I haven't seen those. I feel like a lot of. I feel like a lot of people haven't seen it, and it's a lot like the ET thing, where everyone's like, eh, "It's the worst game." You didn't play ET. That game is bad. I've uh, like not ET, but uh. Zelda. The Zelda games. Oh, man. Like, this is probably better than... Like, the scope of the Zelda games is is a a bit bigger, but I I would bet that this is way more fun to play. Even though the audio is exploding in my ears. What was that? Why didn't you die? You know what? I don't think it was invincibility. I think it was like... It worked the same way... Uh, a get bigger mushroom does in other Mario games. I just didn't get bigger. <laughs> you just got glowy. Nailed it, guys. Yeah. Look at Nailed that fun it. dance that he does. How long are we doing this for? What is it? This has been 15 minutes. This was probably good. Yeah, that's probably good. Do you want to do one more? Do you want to see the next world? Yeah, yeah, I do. I do want to see the next world. Good point. Good point, Keith. We should keep playing Hotel Mario. Thanks. That's what I am. I'm an idea man. I think the Goombas reopen doors at some point. Well, that can get... That's rude. Right? I wish they would have even the flimsiest explanation on why you have to close doors. 
it would make much more sense if you had to open them. Like, it's the same well, thing. I'm sure if backwards. we read the instruction manual like he said. Get fucked. I'm not reading that. I'm not reading that. Oh, God. Huh. Ugh. Whoa, did he open that door? Oh, no, you just didn't close it. You didn't have what it took to close. <gasps> A Koopa. Oh, no. Uh. <laughs> they don't leave their shells. Of course they don't leave their shells. No, they just explode Did into you dust. think that they were going to leave their shell? No. You fucking idiot. I kind of did. <coughs> yeah, I did. I thought that. Uh. You could have made that. Yay! Yeah, you did it. Now the princess can't escape. <laughs> you know what? Are we just assuming that stage four was the last one in World One? We, well, I was assuming that, yeah. Because it wasn't. Because that was a hilarious assumption, It was a Keith. super funny assumption. Oh, yeah, four. That sounds about right. Yeah, it does. Get ready for <laughs> nine. Get ready for <laughs> nine of them. Wrong button. What about him? Uh, <laughs> I I pushed him. I pushed wrong button. Yay! <laughs> That's been Hotel Mario. My my favorite thing about I'll I'll show this real quick. This is my favorite thing about the game. I'm glad you took the time to find something. So, uh, if I'm playing the game here, okay, and I die, he just shrugs. He's like, "I'm accepting my fate." Well, he kind of—that's kind of Mario. I'm thing. accepting my fate. Shrug. I think I think Mario has been known to shrug when dying in Nintendo games. Uh, this one seems a little weirder, and also it the shrug lasts a really long time. He is just kind of like holding He's his like, hands up. Mm, it's less I a shrug and more like, what did Sorry. you expect? What did you... Come on, you piece of shit. Okay, so my favorite thing about the game is that when you get a game over, it rolls credits. <laughs> like, obviously. <laughs> Sorry, but we know you're not going to be starting this again. <laughs> So also, it's unskippable. Also, you can't shut your system off until it's done. Yeah, so that is... That's Hotel Mario. That's Hotel Mario. It's, it's a kind really, of a piece of shit. It's a really, really good game. Oh, we were going... We went opposite ways on that. It's a great game. You'll get it and love it. Buy a $30 emulator and love it. Yeah, yeah. This is the only emulator, and the guy charges $35 for it. Yeah. Oh, not 30 Sorry, 35. I, thought, I, I thought 30 because I was like, oh, 30 is reasonable. No, it's not. I know it's not. It's not reasonable at all. You know what's reasonable? To not ever want a CDI. Like, I like that he gives you the demo version that you can try for three minutes. Mm -hmm. Three minutes. Well, that's how he hooks you. Yeah. Because like, three oh, minutes man, and you're like, this will this perfectly emulate all the great CDI software that I want <laughs> to experience. Like, like when, when, the do when the level that you have to pay is at like five or ten dollars, it's more like, hey, man, like. I'm the only one doing this, and it's a lot of work. Like, and it's can you kind of a, the new, most niche thing of all time. Can, can, can you, you toss kick me, me some few? dollars? Can you just just one dollar? Can you kick me some clams? Can and you I'd get, be like, oh shit, dog, don't even trip. Can you like, kick me some clams? I need it. I need. To, I gotta make steamers. When you're charging like thirty five dollars, you're saying like I'm providing a a service. Yeah. Like I I have a thing that you really want. Yeah, there's a like a a mandatory five dollar donation and thirty five dollars for your CDI Philips CDI emulator. Uh, this uh, emulator cost more than double what Philips headphones cost at CVS. <laughs> and and on Amazon, a Philips CDI system eighty dollars. So it's this not is even an emulator that costs about a third of the actual system. Yeah, less than that. Yeah. More more than that. Sorry, more than a third. Yeah, I'm just agreeing with everything. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, what are you doing? I'm not playing more. It's just we were talking, so it just seemed weird to not have a thing going. No, it didn't. 
Close this. The the other weird thing about Philips CDI I found was it was one of those insane like non-standard systems where there were all different models of CDI and they weren't all made by Philips like other companies made them. So it was like a and steam like, machine. They had different capabilities. Yeah, it was kind of like This is the original a, steam this, machine. This is the original steam machine. Valve is just the worst. I really don't like Valve anymore. Yeah, no, what happened to that? That's it's, that's probably a, a conversation for another day. Yeah, but. sure, we'll talk. Or another episode of a different thing. Let's just leave on this one more time. <laughs> nice of the princess to invite us over. Nice of the princess to invite Luigi. Can you do your best this Mario? She made lots of spaghetti. Luigi. I'm more like oh. Luigi. It's from Bowser. They had to get in that Disney weird Plus. Italian jab. The Koopalings and I have oh, my favorite part's coming out. Mushroom Kingdom. The princess is now a permanent guest at one of my seven Koopa hotels. I dare you to find her if you can. The thing is, find the princess. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. And you gotta help us. If you need, to if, you need to, if you need to, if you hotel, need to, check out the this Mario is kind of horrifying and kind of amazing. He's pretty good, but he's not. This he's like trying to do a. Uh, What's it? Den no, not Dennis Bob Hopper. Hopkins. Bob, Ho Bob, Bob Hoskins. Hoskins. Rest in peace. R yeah, rip in peace, Bob Hoskins. You know, Bob. That's Hoskins how he died. British. He got ripped into pieces. You know, Bob Hoskins is British. He has a no. British accent. I had no. Uh, yeah. No. Right. No. Right. No. Yeah. yeah. Next, you're gonna tell me. Next, you're gonna tell me that Johnny Legs actually talks like that. <laughs> 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 She's beautiful. She's beautiful, Mario. Ah, uh, Mario. Sure, you can take a you can take a ride in the car I know is broken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, in a way, I really wish that weird Brooklyn Mario could come back. Then if you need to, in the way that they have that um. That comic book series, The Star Wars, they need someone to go back and like redub every. They need a ROM hack of every Mario game where he's redubbed with like Brooklyn Mario. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, there's my high score from earlier. <laughs> That's me. That's At me. Times A. I did it. And then. Oh, okay. A plus me. Bye. Ugh. This game sucks. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> no.